Hi, good morning. My name is Margaret and welcome to my uh, my little yoga shala. Um, sorry, I haven't put my lovely painting up yet. It was given to me by a friend because the colours look so beautiful in this room, but um, I will get it up soon. So uh, today I'm going to give you a little five minute solution for those of you who are suffering from neck pain shoulder pain maybe in the upper back it could be from being crouched over a computer or your phone all day um anyway this um this little uh, yoga sequence this little strala yoga sequence for neck stiffness is going to make you feel much better so from wherever you are sitting or standing i want you to ease yourself up uh, to stand so take take care come up with these um, use your body, use whatever you have around you to bring yourself up easy and, um, and start by softening. Just soften your shoulders, soften your knees, your wrists, your palms, so your hips a little side to side. Get really comfortable and movable here. Turn your belly one way and then the other, just allowing your arms to swing so that you're moving from your centre, you're moving from your middle and your arms are just going along for the ride. And then I want you to let that movement from your middle just dissolve. And we're going to come to something that is super, super, super important for releasing stress and tension in the body, and that's your breath. So inhale through the nose and as you inhale through the nose imagine the top of your head floating up towards the ceiling so you grow a little taller and then we'll exhale with a sigh as so though you're fogging up a mirror you hear that that sound that whisper sound in your head we'll do that again inhaling through the nose growing a little taller exhale with that sigh fogging up the mirror everything releasing and softening a little with the exhale. We'll do that again with the inhale, inhaling. And this time you're gonna exhale with the mouth closed, but create that whisper sound in your head. So it's caused by a slight constriction at the back of your throat. And we're going to create that on the inhale as well. You hear that whisper sound, that ocean sound in your head with the exhale, mouth is closed exhaling through the nose so this is your ujjayi breath and this is going to help to slow your breath down it's going to help to keep you focused on the breath and keep you conscious in the present moment and um, this slowing of the breath down will help the body release tension because it's bringing you into the parasympathetic nervous system so that's really important we're going to take Another three breaths, just like this, and we'll just add a little gentle movement in. So when you're ready, inhaling through the nose, whisper sound, float your arms all the way out and up. Bring your palms together, and as you exhale, soften your thumbs into your heartbeat. Did you exhale through the mouth or the nose? Try and exhale through the nose with that whisper sound. Inhale through the nose, whisper sound. Exhale through the nose, whisper sound. And we'll take another inhale through the nose, whisper sound. Exhale through the nose. And let everything soften down here. And we'll add some more gentle movement. So as you inhale, float your arms all the way out and up, bring your palms together. And as you exhale, bend the knees and we'll soften and fold over your legs. Drop your head and neck. Bend the knees enough for your fingertips to meet the mat and let your head hang. Maybe a gentle sway from side to side feels nice. And with each exhalation, imagine your spine lengthening and decompressing. Maybe the top of your head moves a little closer to your toes. Bend the knees as much as you need to. We're gonna roll up here now, rolling up slowly, breathing in through the nose, rolling up vertebra by vertebra, notch by notch. And just let your head float up last. Exhale, relax your shoulders. On your next inhalation, float your arms all the way out and up, bring your palms together. 
As you exhale, mouth is closed, bend the knees and soften and fold all the way over your legs. Drop your head and neck. A little sway from side to side. And then interlace your fingers and very gently just rest your fingers at the back of your skull. There's no need to push or force, just really gently left, resting them. And perhaps you feel your spine lengthening a little more with the gentle weight of your arms. Maybe a little sway from side to side feels nice. Inhale through the nose. Exhale, release your hands down. We're going to roll up again, nice and slowly. Maybe a little sway from side to side as you breathe in. Come up vertebra by vertebra and let your head float up last. On your next inhale, roll your shoulders back and down. Let your shoulder blades slide down your back. And then take your feet apart a little, turn your toes out. You can walk down your body if you need a little bit of support. I'm going to soften all the way down. Let your fingertips meet the mat and support you and sink into an easy squat, a gentle roll from side to side. If you feel comfortable here, perhaps you can tiptoe your fingertips out a little more and relax your neck completely. Let your chin drop towards your chest let your head be heavy and then if it feels nice interlace your fingers and just rest them on the back of your skull and let your arms relax completely and as you breathe in breathe into the back of your neck as you exhale Exhale through the nose, allowing your chin to drop towards your chest. Let your arms relax. Let your head be heavy. And gently release your arms down. Take your hands behind you. Lean back and ease yourself down into a nice, comfortable, seated position. As you breathe in, imagine the top of your head floating up. I'm just going to turn to the side and I want you to imagine a piece of string running from your tailbone, the very bottom of your spine, all the way up through your spinal column, gently coming out of the top of your head and gently just drawing you up, creating space in between the vertebrae of your your spine. And on your next exhalation, just allow your shoulders to slide down your back without losing any of that lovely height. As you inhale, top of the head floats up. And as you exhale, just allow your left ear to drop towards your left shoulder without lifting your shoulders. Inhale into this stretch you feel on the right side. And as you exhale, we'll very, very gently circle your head all the way around, bringing the right ear to the right shoulder and then allowing your head to float up. Inhale, grow a little taller, top of the head floats up and as you exhale, we'll drop the right ear towards the right shoulder. Inhale, breathing into the stretch that you feel here and as you exhale, just allowing your chin to drop down and taking a really easy, gentle roll, bringing the left ear back to the left shoulder and then allowing your head to float up. And there you have it, a very simple routine to help relieve some stiffness and some tension in your neck and shoulders and perhaps even in your upper back. The breath is super important the slowing of your breath down, the breathing through the nose will release tension in your body and will bring you into the parasympathetic response, um, which is the opposite of fight or flight or freeze, and tension and go, go, go. It's much more about rest, digest, relaxation and releasing stiffness in the body. So I hope that makes you feel uh, a little better and my name is Margaret. I'm Estrella Guide here in Marbella and online. So I hope to see you again soon. Have a lovely day.